Have you ever wondered how a tiny seed transforms into a towering tree? It's a question that prompts us to marvel at the magic of nature, the life of plants. It all starts with a seed, a tiny capsule, carrying the blueprint of a future plant. But it doesn't stop there. The journey of a plant from seed to mature organism is a fascinating spectacle, a dance of life filled with stages and transitions. But there's more to it than meets the eye. These stages are not just a simple progression of growth, but a complex series of events, each one vital to the development and survival of the plant. From germination to growth, flowering to fruiting, each phase is a testament to the resilience and adaptability of nature's green soldiers. So you see, the life of a plant is far from ordinary. It's a testament to the intricate and beautiful processes that make life on Earth possible. Let's delve deeper into these stages to gain a better understanding of how plants grow. It all starts with a seed, a tiny package of potential. This minuscule marvel, often unnoticed, houses the beginnings of a new plant life. The magic truly begins when the seed makes contact with water. This initiates the process of germination where the seed absorbs water, causing it to swell and eventually break open. Within this swelling seed, a transformation is taking place. The stored nutrients, the plant's initial fuel source, are being utilized to grow a root. This tiny root, though seemingly insignificant, serves a critical role. It anchors the plant to the ground, providing stability and grounding, while also absorbing water and nutrients. This root, the first sign of life from the seed, is the plant's initial interaction with the world outside its seed shell. It is the beginning of a new existence, a life that will grow, flourish, and eventually reproduce. Once the seed has sprouted, it's ready to begin its journey towards becoming a mature plant. With roots firmly in the ground, the plant is now ready to reach for the sky. This is the growth phase, a remarkable stage in a plant's life where it transforms from a tiny seedling into a mature plant. This transformation is not just a matter of getting taller, but it's also about developing a complex structure of stems, leaves, and eventually flowers. So how does a plant achieve this fascinating growth? It's all down to a trio of essential elements, sunlight, water, and nutrients. The plant harnesses sunlight through its leaves in a process known as photosynthesis. In this extraordinary process, sunlight is converted into chemical energy, which fuels the plant's growth. Water is another key player, not just for hydration, but also as a transporter. It carries nutrients from the soil to the plant and helps distribute the energy produced during photosynthesis. Nutrients, the third element, are sourced from the soil. They provide the plant with the necessary compounds to carry out vital functions and support growth. As the plant continues to grow, it undergoes many changes. It grows taller, its stem becomes thicker and stronger, and it produces more leaves. These leaves are not just for show, they play a crucial role in photosynthesis, capturing more sunlight and thus creating more energy. Eventually the plant reaches maturity and produces flowers. These blooms are not only beautiful to behold, they're also the plant's ticket to reproduction. With flowers in bloom, the plant is now ready to reproduce. A plant's ultimate goal is to reproduce and ensure the survival of its species. For many plants, the journey towards reproduction begins with the enchanting dance of pollination. Here, grains of pollen, each carrying the male genetic material, embark on a thrilling adventure, often aided by the wind, water, or a myriad of creatures, to reach the female parts of a flower. This union leads to the creation of seeds, the encapsulation of new life and hope for the future. The creation of seeds marks the completion of a plant's life cycle. Each seed is like a tiny time capsule, carrying within it the blueprint for a new plant, ready to burst forth when conditions are right. It's an insurance policy against extinction, a testament to the resilience and tenacity of life itself. But what becomes of the plant after it has produced seeds? Well, much like the diversity we see in the plant kingdom, there's no one-size-fits-all answer. Some plants, after a grand and glorious display of flowering and seed production, will die. This is known as monocarpic, 
They put all their energy into one grand finale of reproduction, ensuring their legacy lives on through their seeds. On the other hand, there are the perennials, plants, that live and reproduce for many years, continuously producing seeds and contributing to the diversity and richness of our ecosystems. Thus, the cycle continues, with each new seed carrying the potential to grow into a new plant. From a humble seed to a magnificent plant, the life cycle of plants is a testament to the wonders of nature. We've embarked on an incredible journey, delving into the captivating process of germination, the silent growth from a seedling to a mature plant, and the marvel of reproduction. We've witnessed the inevitable cycle of life and death. So next time you see a plant, remember the incredible journey it has embarked upon to stand tall before you today.